What up? It is the on the road version of the question of the day. When was a time you decided to do something that you didn't know the outcome of, but you decided to do it anyway? Okay, so let's talk about this. When was a time that you were like, I don't know what I'm doing. I just, I just need to do it anyway. Comment below and come be part of this judgment-free conversation. I started this channel and these questions as a form of support, right? Let's unite, not untie. Let's take care of each other. Let's listen to each other. Let's hear what is going on in the world. So comment below. When was a time that you're just like, I don't know what I'm doing, but you know what? I'm just going to do it anyway, even though we don't know what's going to happen. So what about you, Caitlin? I got my awesome friend Caitlin here with me. She's amazing and awesome. So, so well, this weekend we're on our way back from the Women's March in Washington, D.C. And for me, I made this decision to come join a group of people that I barely knew, stay in people's homes that we hadn't met before, rely on the kindness of strangers and hope for the best. And also hope for the best in terms of our safety and our well-being during the march. And I'm not sure about what the outcome will be. We've started a lot of conversations. I think that has been the most rewarding part of taking part in the Women's March, but uh, we're not sure what the outcome will be. What the outcome will be tomorrow versus the outcome a year from now. Hopefully all of this coming together, building sisterhood, staying with these women that I had never met before has felt like we built a small community, a small sisterhood, and uh, we don't know what the outcome will be in the long term, but I'm really grateful for everything that's happened already. Yeah, so we are driving back. I think we're in the middle of Ohio right now. We are um, we are driving back from uh, D.C. on our way back to Chicago, and, you know, we all went to the Women's March. I'm in a van of six women, and there's another van that's traveling with us, another van of six women, and some of us knew each other, and some of us didn't, and we stayed with this amazing woman named Jade who kindly opened up her house through her friend Mackie, who we just don't even know who they are, but, like, we just know them through, like, friends of friends, and it was incredible to see the camaraderie to see the connection and to see like everything going on and no we don't know the outcome in fact the 12 of us who sometimes some of us knew and some of us didn't we didn't even know the outcome of this you know 72 hour trip but we're like we got to do it because you just sometimes have to make a decision sometimes i call it the roller coaster effect right it's exciting and it's scary but we just have to do it and just take a leap and see what's going to happen so that, I mean, that's what we got. So that's a little bit about us. Uh, now we want to hear from you. Comment below and come be part of this judgment-free conversation. And um, hey, while you're here, subscribe. Come hang out with us. This is kind of a cool place to be. Seriously, it's like crazy cool. And um, invite a friend because the more people that are part of this conversation, the sooner we can change the world. Oh, that didn't really work. Let's try that again. Change the world. <laughs> cool. Thanks.